I would think it's stronger to feel with your heart alone. And in a way it is, because you just it's the passion of the of the of the thought of the of the heart unchecked by the intellect. But when you combine the intellect, the thoughts, the higher level thoughts with an emotion, if you combine those two things, what will end up happening is that the intellect will integrate itself into the emotions and therefore it won't fade as quickly, the feeling won't fade. If I just feel something, almost like a compulsive feeling, even if it's a spiritual feeling, it means it has a certain limitation. It doesn't have, when I have a, when I have a ide ideology behind the feeling, that can last a lot longer, especially if the ideology is a true, based on truth and not falsehood. It's like if you see somebody and they look beautiful and you feel right away something, but you don't know them. It's not based on information, it's just based on one thing alone, vision, how the person looks. And you could be imagining in your head how great they are and how beautiful a person they are, but you don't really know that. So you're lacking knowledge. So even though the emotion might be more intense, but ultimately it's gonna, you'll find out. I know so many people say every time they've fallen in love with somebody that they've just met, you know, they just see without knowing, it's always in the long run turn out to be a false alarm. So that's why when you combine intellect with emotions, that means you've thought it through, it makes sense, the emotion is gonna be, is, gonna, is compatible with what's real to you and, and integrated into your ideas. It's gonna last.